So what kind of options down the road do I see in terms of you know, being able to uh, get, gain access to my facility data since everybody has kind of contributed? So uh, he used Reflector earlier to show his iPad on the screen. So this is another project we were involved with. This is the convention center. And so you can see it's got terrain, it's got roads, it's got the shells of those buildings. And so you can navigate on the, on the mobile app within InfraWorks to kind of see from various vantage points, you know, what this, what this information looks like. And maybe you have a job shop, or maybe you have a computer loaded up with this model so that I can, instead of looking at a series of PDFs or a series of drawings before I go out to a, 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 a main break, I get myself sort of acclimated with where I'm going using something like this uh, as the interface. Uh, and then again, there's many multiple apps. That, this one's Autodesk 360. So again, that 360 is available on your, on your browser as well. What's cool about having now the support for not just drawings and DWIFs, which you're pretty familiar with, it now supports Navis files and Reddit files. And the cloud on the back end takes the data when you upload it and it starts to like carve it up like the Thanksgiving turkey, right? So it, it can actually give you all the views. So it, it has the elevations, it has the floor plans, all those significant things that if you were in Revit, you would want to get to, or if you were in Navis, you'd want to get to, those things have all been uh, created for you so that you can jump to any one of those particular points. And then you can activate the view like this, and you can literally see your 3D model available to you. So all of those extended sets of information then become available from a viewing perspective out on one of the apps, the commenting, the sharing it back. Um, there's another field application that's designed for people to do uh, QA, QC, and punch listing, and, and checklisting, and, and resolve issues in the field. Those things are available as well. Um, and Angel will touch upon those a little bit here in his next segment. <coughs> so there's the Revit file. Same kind of concept. Get to details, be able to pick on a detail, be able to zoom in on a detail, see all the intelligence that you had from the drawing. Right there at your fingertips. 